familia, buenos días para mí, buenas tardes para ustedes. Today I'm going to do a what's in my purse uh, video. And then I started thinking, if I'm going to show you a what's in my purse video, I might as well show you all of my purses. So I'm going to show you what's in the current purse that I use right now, and then I'm going to show you all of my purse collections that I have. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get straight into the video. So this is my current bag right now. This is my new bag for fall. If you go to my previous video, come fall shopping with me, I went to Bell's Outlet to look for fall decor for my home and I saw this bag and I went back to get it because I just fell in love with it. Um, it's the perfect color. It's a nice nude brown. Um, it is Steve Madden. I got it for 30 bucks at Bell's Outlet. Don't sleep on Bell's Outlet. Um, but yeah, this is her. She's so small. She's so cute. She's so compact, but there's plenty of room inside to hold everything that I need. Um, when I'm out throughout the day, this has literally everything that I need fits inside of this bag. And I currently use it right now as a crossbody just because I have the baby and it's, you know, cute as a crossbody and I don't have to worry about grabbing it and holding it, but you could take these straps off and use it as a regular bag with the handle, little arm situation. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and look inside and see what I have. So the purse has three compartments. It has a front, a middle, and a back. The front compartment I use for things that I need to get to quickly. So my house keys, my car keys, um, things that I need to have a quick access to, I keep in the front pocket. And then things that I need to take out of my purse, things that don't normally belong in my purse on a daily basis, I put in the back pocket. So like if I go to a doctor's appointment and they give me an appointment card for another doctor's appointment, I'll put the appointment card in the back because I'm not going to keep that in my purse forever. Um, if I go grocery shopping and they give me a receipt, if I don't need the receipt, I put it here in the back pocket because then later on I can just throw it out. So things I need to get to quickly, I keep in the front and things that I need to throw away quickly, I put in the back pocket. So in the front pocket, Things that I have quick access to is my car keys, my house key. I have some hand lotion in case my hands get dry. I like to put on lotion to keep them moisturized throughout the day. And of course, with COVID and everything going on, germs floating around, flu season coming upon us now, I always, always, always keep a hand sanitizer. And I always keep the little ones because they're so compact from Bath and Body Works. Right now I'm using pineapple mango, but summer's already over, so I'm going to be switching this one to maybe like an apple cinnamon or a maple something for fall, just to go with the bag and to go like the scent to smell like fall, since we're going into the fall season. So in the front, I normally keep like cash. Um, if I need to access some cash quickly, I'll keep a uh, hand sanitizer, hand lotion, car keys, and house keys mainly in the front. And then in the back, I don't have anything because again, I put things in there that I need to take out the same day. Like things, I don't keep things unnecessary in my purse at all. And then the middle section has this nice gold. Everything is a uh, nude brown and gold. So this gold goes all the way from one side to the other and then once I show you everything inside my bags I'll show you how much room I have um, again this bag I got it at Bell's outlet I will link down below or right down below all the bags that I'm gonna show you and where I got them from and how much I bought them for so if you do like a bag that I show you and you want to go purchase it or see if the store still has it and purchase it you're more than welcome to 
And then in the middle compartment, there is three sections as well. There's the, the big square pocket on the side, the long rectangular uh, pocket on the side next to the big square. There's the zipper compartment and then the middle compartment. So in the big squared compartment on the side um, of the bag on the inside, I usually put my phone. If I put my phone in my purse, I put it in the big squared compartment. So that's empty right now because my phone's not in there. And then on the long uh, rectangular compartment next to the big square, I keep my glasses. Um, I am blind at night, you guys. I cannot see. I swear, I always tell Manuel I'm like an old lady in a young girl's body. I always tell him, like, I'm blind. I can't see at night. He says I'm deaf. I can't hear. Worth a damn. Um, I can't see. I can't hear. I'm just, I'm like deteriorating guys i feel like i have early alzheimer's like knock on wood but i do i can't remember anything at all like yeah it's just bad <laughs> but in that compartment i keep my glasses for at night driving i normally don't drive at night if we go out at night i go with manuel of course i'm never driving by myself at night but if i do have to run somewhere um i have my glasses and yeah that's in that compartment. And then in the zipper compartment, let's get everything out. In the zipper compartment, I keep a pen, of course, if I have to take notes or write something down or sign something, I like to use my own pen. I don't like to grab those pens that they give you like at doctor's offices, like here, everybody can grab one. Community pens, I don't do. I have my own pen, hence the hand sanitizer. Um, I have my Color Street tinted lip balm. Speaking of, <laughs> I love, love, love this, you guys. Um, this is on Amazon, you can purchase it. I got this at a consignment store for $3, brand new in the box, sealed, um, Color Street tinted lip balm, and this does not have a color, it's just tinted lip balm, but it's the pink one. Love, love, love this. I always keep a lip balm and then a lip gloss. I have Galaxy lip gloss. I think I got this at Burlington and like a lip gloss kit because my lips were dried and I was like, let me just buy a lip gloss um, really quick. And then I have the Maybelline New York Lifter Gloss. These are bomb. I wanna go get the gummy bear and all those colored ones that they have. But I love, love, love this color because it's just neutral and gives me a nice gloss. And this is in 020 Sun. Really, really good, you guys. If you don't have this in your collection, you need to grab it. The Lifter Gloss from Maybelline. Not sponsored, but I do love it. I do, do love it. And then in the middle compartment, I have just a body spray. I always keep a little miniature body spray. You know, you have to smell good all the time, you know? Give yourself a little spray if you're going somewhere. Need a little touch up. I have in the middle compartment some wipes. I have the baby, so I always need to make sure that I'm wiping my hands down, sanitizing my hands. I have my coach wallet. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna show you guys what's inside my wallet, but it's just a normal wallet, credit cards, money, things like that. And then lastly, I always keep bond and seal glue and some loose lashes. If I'm ever feeling like I'm balding or one just happens to come off if I rub my eye or something, I can do a quick little touch up. Always, always have your lashes done. Always, always have your lashes done. Always, always. All right, you guys. So, yes. Yeah, so, this is the bag. This is my current fall bag. Steve Madden, $30. Bell's Outlet. Go get you one. They have a nice 
uh, cranberry pink gish purple um, I might go back and get that one um, but I love browns I obviously you can see my house white nude gold browns I'm this is my color palette I love 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 it fall is like my favorite season so in the front I'll show you the space you have a good amount of space in there for the front same in the back and then the middle if you could see these are the two compartments I was talking about my phone goes here my glasses go here the zipper compartment is pretty big and the middle is like very very spacious um, so yeah this is her I'm gonna name her Carmela she's like a caramel brown color I like it and then my next bag is my coach <laughs> you I think every girl has this bag in their bag collection um, it's just the staple coach tote uh, crossbody as well you can take the the straps off and use it just like this I do both with the baby I'm into a lot of crossbodies right now but once you know she's a little bigger and I don't have to maneuver as much I'll start you know using the handles again um, this has the three compartments as well the front the back I find the Steve Madden has more space in the compartments than the coach but I mean to each its own and then the middle compartment as well zipper part the middle is pretty spacious it's about the same space um but yeah coach and then of course I got the matching wallet to go with the purse but right now I'm using the coach wallet with my Steve Madden just because I haven't found a nice wallet Steve Madden wallet or a wallet in general just to go with that bag yet um, but yeah, I have the matching wallet with this bag. This bag was 119 at the Coach Outlet Store in West Palm Beach, uh, Palm Beach Lake Outlets. Um, $119. I got this there when I was living there. And then I got this beautiful cream nude snakeskin all those bag at burlington coat factory don't sleep on burlington for the bags either burlington ross marshall's tj maxx and bell's outlet i love to shop there for bags i love a good i'm the type of girl that it doesn't matter how much it costs it could be ten dollars it could be ten thousand dollars if i like it and i can rock it and i have an outfit for it i'm gonna buy it i'm gonna buy it like i don't need name brand louis vuitton all of that like right now you're gonna see in this collection coach is the most expensive brand that i have right now and it's because i haven't found a louis vuitton bag that calls my name i haven't found a gucci bag that calls my name i literally my bags speak to me when i see them and everywhere i go i dress bags up i dress them down and people are always like i love your purse i love your bag because it's not it's not more so the brand or the bag it's more so how you dress her with your outfits how you how you make her look with you that makes the staple if that makes sense but i did get this all those bag this bag was $30 as well $29.99 at Burlington and it has just a little lock and key super cute snakeskin cream situation my work name tag is in there with a scrunchie but I haven't used this bag but that's what the inside looks like just a little pocket inside and then it, this is a little pocket here as well all those $30 Burlington coach 119 coach outlet and Steve Madden $30 bells outlet <clears throat> and then I got you guys this is all those as well I got this bag here 
for six dollars at a consignment store you can look i'm a firm believer in one person's trash is another person's treasure this has every single color that i love okay the brown the gold the chains the nude just a little side note for someone who is deathly phobically if that's even a word afraid of snakes i own two snake skin bags i rather them die and be on a bag than be in this world that's how scared i am of snakes um but yes like my cup these are my color palettes the dark brown the brown the nude the gold six dollars at a consignment store at a thrift store um all those if you have a consignment store if you have a thrift store salvation army goodwill consignment don't hesitate to stop and go in there and just look around it doesn't hurt to look around and and some people like are just tired of good good items and they just end up throwing them out and i saw this bag and i was like this will go perfect with an outfit that i've been looking for a bag to go with and i couldn't find one and it was literally a snakeskin skirt with a brown top and this bag went perfectly with it and i was like oh my god and six dollars i went everywhere i looked at all those in the mall um i went to burlington bell's outlet ross marshall cj maxx i could not find a bag for that outfit and i went to a consignment store with my mom she was like i love this store come in with me and i just looked around and i found this and i found a stanley cup dupe um but yeah this is an Aldo's bag I got for $6 at a thrift consignment store. And last but not least, if you know me, you know pink is life. I have this beautiful pink Aldo's bag, lock and key, little bow, scarf situation. This one comes with straps as well, but it's so big I don't use it as a crossbody. I use it as a handle. And then just the all pink inside, everything pink. I got this wallet to go with it. It matched perfectly. Steve Madden, I got this from Burlington. I'm trying to find something like this for the brown fall bag, but I got this wallet at Burlington to go with the bag. And then it has the two compartments, glasses to drive at night because I'm blind again. Zipper. I'm trying to open. The bag is big, you guys. But I'm trying to show you guys the inside. Big compartment. But yeah, pink and gold. Super pretty. I love the blush light baby pink. It's one of my favorite colors besides gold brown nudes um but yeah you guys that is my bag collection i love 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 to shop i love to look for bags that you know just speak to me um again i don't care how much it costs i will buy it um don't sleep on consignment stores thrift stores burlington ross tj maxx marshall's um they all have really good bags for a really good price why pay 300 dollars for a bag when you could pay 30. <laughs> so i love you guys los amo cuídense mucho por ahí los veo en el próximo video take care be safe be blessed um, be kind be respectful and be considerate of others i love you guys i will see you in the next video